こたんとんにしちけ英傑にどく落ちぬ日はなく月もなし僕と我が作五郎次郎語らずの陣Hello everyone! Welcome back for some more Let's Play Fate Grand Order. We are done with grinding. I fought a hundred plus Barbadoses. It was actually pretty easy. I just macroed it.、Um, this event is a lot. There's a lot of grinding. I still have lots of grinding to do. It's like I like the ideas presented in it, but boy, geez, there is. There's a reason you're given so much time to do it. Anyways, we're heading back to the Rail Zeppelin now, now that we've、uh, defeated Nemesine, who was the fake Da Vinci.、And、that boss was hard too. I had to do that like four times to try and do it without needing a revive. That's a legitimately really tough fight.、Um, but okay, the good news is here we are a fictitious return, singularity, infiltration. Also, I've put the music down really quiet. Really quiet. Because turns out, even at like 1% volume, like I had to remove almost all the audio last time, I've cranked up. Well, I've no, I've just left the, the sound effects and stuff normal. But then, like this, you'll hear that. No issues there. But the music I have at level one. So hopefully, by the time I balance it as I normally do, it'll be fine. Anyways, yes, we did beat we did beat Nemesine and stop the firing of the Rongo Miniad. I think it's over. So it would seem. The automata, automata. I always say this one weird. Because you can say the automata, you could say the automata, you could say the like near automata or near automata. Like, people say both, right? Anyways, the automata, the sacred lens has been sending out, have all shut down. The bounded field around the singularity is gone. We can now enter the singularity ourselves. Got it. You good with that, Tanner? Yeah, what are we waiting for? Let's go. Choo choo. Uh oh. I'm gonna choo choo my way to nearing heaven because I'm dying. What? Tanner? Uh oh. The memories. Autonomic Observational Existence Verification System Nemesign. Yes, that's right. I'm the subsystem that was created to verify Master's existence during a ray shift. So he's like, this, this song here was a super big problem. I have very high hopes for you, Nemesine. Order, return to us. I am Reddit et Virgo. I know that's not how you say it. Probably read it. Right up to her very last moment, her second life was absolutely perfect. I know you said you had to use her loss properly, but the thing is, you really don't. She, or I, never regretted anything, not for a single second. That's why Tanner's here right now. I think that was the last burst of feedback. Are you all right? Uh, yeah, I'm fine. Come on, let's go. Understood. Beginning entry into the singularity. Ley line connection confirmed. Constructing ether track. Oh, apparently. You know how I was like, I didn't remember that from the. Thing. Yeah, apparently, a lot of the stuff they're talking about here is light novel exclusive, which again is more proof why I want to get to those light novels eventually. And there's people that are always like, When are you doing this? When are you doing this? I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it all. It's just there's just so much, and I gotta do it, you know, in time and in order. So we'll get to it. Just you wait. Whoa! Train tracks just appeared in midair! If I was like 10 years younger, this would be the coolest thing ever. But now I have to like pretend to not be into trains. Cause you know, there's a there's a whole thing where like if you're into trains, like that's that's kind of a negative thing. Okay. Trains are pretty cool though. Trains are pretty cool.
Okay, well, there we go. We got some gray coins and a Saint Quartz. That's very nice. Hey, look at that! Whoa! Choo choo! A fictitious return. Why well, done it? Okay. We're doing more. I, I don't know where this is going. Like, is this going to be turned into like a sequel? Now that it's like past the end? Because there is no post game for this one. It's such a long event that there is no like post campaign. So we'll have to see. Have we reached our destination? Are we going to see ourselves? Fake Rongo Minion. It's falling apart. It's not just Rongo Minion. This whole singularity is about to collapse. Looks like the Kalians have already picked up and left. Oh. Oh, they've just already left. So we're going to get to see what happens at the end of a singularity? You. Uh, let's just go with Nemesign. I just had a dream. A wonderful dream. Who are... Oh, I see. You must be the memories my other self was protecting. Wait, your other self? Wait, what? What are you talking about? You have a whole other self? Well, I suppose it would be more accurate to say she's still me, but with a different perspective. After I woke up, we spent quite a lot of time arguing back and forth. I was originally intended to serve as a means to watch over Master, but I was divided as to whether I should perform my role according to spec or whether I should take a more proactive approach. I prevailed in our disagreement and relegated the part of me that wanted to, op to operate to spec in a kind of solitary confinement. I've confirmed that my other self escaped while I was stealing Master's memories. Wait, where did your other self go? I'm not completely sure, but I can make an educated, that is, a calculated guess. As she had no means of escaping me in the singularity, she likely fled to the rail zeppelin. Wait, but that's the train we were just on! Yes. I can easily calculate what my other self would have done at the time. Oh, well, it's a good thing you can, because I'd like to know. I finally made it. I'm out of the fringe of the singularity. My haywire self can't reach me here. Did you guide me here? This is where Tanner's true memories are being kept, but I'll never be able to protect them like this. I'm operating at barely 3% capacity. So then... So that's us. Infusing the memories with personality. Complete. Output falling. Thirteen minutes until complete system failure. Did I do it? Did I live up to your expectations for me? No, this won't work. It's just not enough. He needs someone to protect him. But I don't have the necessary magical energy left to summon any... Wait. Yes, I do. I'm still here. I'm still at 2.7% of my original capacities. Initiating search for servants summonable under current environmental conditions and resource restrictions. Searching, searching one match found. Activating heroic spirit pseudo summoning system fate. Oh. Seventy-three percent ritual output deficiency detected. Sixty-one percent magecraft precision deficiency detected. Initiating deconstruction of autonomic observational existence verification system Nemesign to assist with summoning. Pseudosystem activation stable. Initiating summon. My servant. Please keep Master safe. So she was the one that summoned it. Okay. Well, her. Okay. Well, that explains where we were and everything. So that's how Faker and I wound up on this train. To protect you, Tanner's true name memories... My other self gave you personality and put you on board the rail zeppelin. Unfortunately, I'm also completely certain that's what happened. I'm speaking about a part of myself, after all. And she turned out exactly as our creator intended. Nemesign. So then, the reason I remember my past summoning is... Because I'm mixed in with you. Oh! Oh! My other self used her own body to compensate for the shortfall of magical energy. That means the formulas that created me are embedded in your spirit origin. I was created to preserve memories and to be a sleepless sentry, regardless of world or timeline. Hey, they for once have a pretty decent explanation as to why they remember stuff. 
Consequently, I expect you'll always retain your memories, as long as you are summoned by Kaldia's own summoning system. Oh, well, hey, look at that. As long as I'm summoned by Kaldia, huh? Well, this is weird. Must be why I'm in this bizarre class. I might look like by myself, but it's more like someone else wearing my identity. Oh, that's why she's pretender and not faker? Strange. Really roundabout. I can't even be called faker. I'm an outright pretender. Huh, no wonder I couldn't leave this guy to fend for himself. As for you... Mm-hmm. As for me? Or him? Wait, true name extraction? Wait, what? Hephaestian Nemesine? Oh my god, okay. I didn't even know that was gonna be a thing. Well, shoot, okay. Huh. I... Well, okay. Is every... Faker class going to have that? Sorry, Pretender class? Huh. Weird. I feel like I saw the name Hephaestian Nemesine before, like I saw it, and it didn't even click with me what it meant. I thought it was like, oh, is that just Hephaestian's last name that, like, we forgot or didn't learn about in the anime? Nope, it apparently was a spoiler that I somehow entirely missed. I thought you wouldn't have any further need of them, so I came to collect. <laughs> I see. The rail zeppelin is everything I imagined and more. My creator gave these to me, but you're right. I don't need them anymore. Go ahead. Lowercase t, take them. Thank you. Acting manager, if you would. God, she is weird. We still don't know what's up with that alien priestess either. I wonder if they're related in some way. Because they're both drawn very similarly. Also, we ripped out her eyeballs, I just realized. And there we are. Thank you for your generosity. It's no problem. Here, take these two. Oh, that's just a that's just a bunch of mystic eyes. That's a lot of mystic eyes. Right. Those are the mystic eyes Dr. Heartless used in my world. Aldi ended up using uh ended up with them in this world, huh? They were turning uh, tuning those mystic eyes to your own so you could use them all at once. I never would have thought to try that. Wait, so you used Mystic Eyes for your observations? They were one of my primary mediums, yes. Dr. Marisbury procured them for me. That's intriguing. How would he have so many Mystic Eyes? Yeah, Olga's father. Huh. In our world, Lord Marisbury obtained them at auction. Yeah, because, like, well, wait. When you say Lord Marisbury, there's two different Lord Marisburys we might be talking about. We're talking about... We're talking about the, the dad, but you might be talking about Lord Old. Wait, or maybe I don't know. Are you talking about? Are we talking about the same one? The one right here on the rail zeppelin, huh? So that was the connection you used to come to the singularity. Then you came here for the Mystic Eyes. Then I guess I shouldn't have expected anything less from the Mystic Eyes collection train. Anyway, the singularity is going to disappear soon. You should contact Kaldi and have them come pick you up. Wait, wait, why am I fading? What's happening? Tanner, what's wrong? It's like all my strength just faded. Damn it, you're starting to disintegrate. We need to get to back to Kaldia fast. You're not going to last much longer. Are you sure you need to send him back? Remember, the clone there is just a small part of the true Tanner. People are made up of a mind, body, and soul. These memories are nothing more than a fragment of Tanner's mind. Tanner will be fine, even without them. In fact, based on the data I have, he should be almost fully recovered by now. Uh, can I live? That doesn't make it okay for any part of Tanner to disappear. Come on, stand up. Stand up, dammit, or I'll drag you up. I formed a contract with you, remember? You, no one else. So stand up, Tanner. That's a big ask. My legs are gone. There you go. Why are you doing this? The only memories Tanner will lose will be of the rail zeppelin, and that was only experienced by a tiny fragment of his mind. Even if reabsorbed, all the true Tanner will feel is a slight sense of deja vu. 
I'll just think it was a dream. Yeah, well, we kind of go through a lot of those, and most of my dreams I kind of think of as actually happening at this point. It's all just so unremarkable. Caldia didn't see it, so it won't even be recorded in its database. So what's the point of going all this effort just to bring those memories back to him? What's the point? You already know, Nemesine. You don't need me to tell you. You think of the dead Da Vinci and the new one as different people too, right? Doesn't matter if most of their memories are the same. If this part of him disappears, something irreplaceable is lost. Even if nobody remembers? Not even Tanner himself. But you already said it yourself. I'll remember. The next time I'm summoned, I'll remember all of this. Faker. Doesn't matter if this all just seems like a dream or something he imagined. What matters is that he gets back where he belongs. This is just like a dream we all shared. A silly dream in which... We all see the endless sea. It's okay if the dream shatters. He still has to bring back the fragments. Rongo Mini it is! It looks like I made this secret land so a little too much like the genuine article. Go on, get out of here. Caldia may have left this singularity when this uh, when the singularity began Woo! Caldia may have left when the singularity began to repair itself. Rongo Mini is still undergoing one last transformation before it finally falls apart. At this point, even I can't control it. I have no way to calculate what may happen. Tanner, Faker, we couldn't have come this far if not for you showing us the way. I think it's time I return the favor. Please get on board the train. Don't worry, my rail zeppelin can make it out of this singularity. But what about you, Nemesine? And they're both like, yes, no, no, the, 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 the one with the, blonde, the, the brown hair and the big boobs. And they're both like, yes. And it's like, damn it. Thank you for your concern, but I'm afraid I cannot leave. I'm tied too tightly to the singularity, even if I did created it. Even if I did create it? Mm. Even if I did create it to use for observation. If I tried to force my way out now, I'd disappear just like my other self did. It's all right. It was a wonderful dream and I enjoyed it very much. Come on, we need to go. Hurry, Tanner. Please go on ahead. May good fortune find you on your journey. Bye, name is Sign. I completely forgot you existed, and when I saw your boss fight, I was like, wow, I don't even, didn't even remember this. Rail Zeppelin all aboard. He kind of looks like a shadow Jeff Keeley, doesn't he? You know? Like, he looks like he's about to announce that Death Stranding 2 will feature him. You know? I'm not the only one who sees that, right? Yeah, oh, well, yeah, we're making our way out, kind of. What? Ooh, we got a battle. Format restricted. What's going on here? What are we dealing with? What sort of wild... Is it going to be shadow versions of the of the crew? Because I saw a caster there. What is that? Was what? Uh oh. That was very loud. Rongo Mini just transforming again. What, what in the world's going on? Why does it do that? The Sacred Lance defenses must have kicked in. Damn it, Nemesis, you did too damn good of a job copying it. Then... As far as I know, the true Rongo Mini is tightly restrained. But what if Rongo Mini didn't have any sort of restraints? And what if all of a Holy Grail's magical energy got poured into it right before those restraints were lifted? Wait, a Holy Grail's magical energy poured into the Sacred Lance? ruh -roh. The Lance is an anchor used to hold this world's textures in place, but it also has the potential to become a network capable of modifying those textures. But a chain reaction like that could only happen in this singularity. Remember the memory we caught a glimpse of? The one that said memories are a highly potent source of energy in the singularity? That huge mass of memories Nemesine accumulated must have affected Rongo Minion somehow. It's not just a fake Rongo Minion anymore. It's like a chaotic double. A nega Rongo Minion! Oh my god! That's cringe! That's cringe Kino! You can't just throw, like... That is ridiculously loud and blowing out my headphones. I feel like I'm dying. Why is that the loudest sound ever? Emergency! Emergency! Hostiles are massing on the tracks ahead. This is very bad. They're blocking the whole track. Not even the rail zeppelin can force its way through that many monsters. We gotta be doing it on purpose. Probably more like instinct. 
They're desperate to keep us here. They must have decided everything in the Singularity exists to serve as magical energy for them. These enemies came from falsifying the textures acquired from Nemesine's records. They may leave us alone if we don't try to escape, but that will leave us caught in the Singularity's efforts to repair itself. Ah, oh, damn it. Come on, Tanner, let's get rid of those things. I'll lead the way in my chariot. Wait, you can do that? We're consuming a lot of magical energy, but we haven't got a choice. Now follow me. Okay, what are, what are we doing? Are we just zip-zooming about on the chariot? Here I go. I can definitely release my noble phantasm out here. Oh, Hecate, bless me with your guidance. My name is a lie, my body is a shadow, but these falsehoods are my pride. Once again, I hold these reins in my hands. Shatter them, Hecatic Wheel! A flying chariot. Get in. I will. Not my first time on this sort of thing. Now, battling while doing it, that might be actually a little more difficult. Out of our way, weaklings. Oh, well, no, we're hopping in right in. Okay. Is it going to be we can't use Hephaestian, or is it you have to use Hephaestian? Let's see here. Well, that answers that. Okay. Well, um, honestly, I could just do... You two can just... Yeah, yeah, you two can rock it, right? I'm just going to stick with this, because you guys kind of know what to do. Okay. And we only got the... The couple, but that should be fine. Should be fine. We do some regular stuff, some actual fighting. We don't gotta worry about buster looping and stuff. I mean, we'll do it, but only a couple times. Mm. Love me some water. Water is the best. Drinking water makes me so happy. How's there people out there that are like, oh, I don't like to drink water? Like, bruh, how do you look? Oh, frick! Shoot, you're single target though, right? Yeah, I'm not doing your stuff. Well, this is really good for us. This is really good for us. I forgot I didn't think they'd use this mechanic. This makes me so happy. Get that on you. Um, We don't have... Hmm, I think I'm gonna go just with, yeah, we'll just do a ray. You know, we'll go, let's see here. Who can, I think you might not die. So we'll go one, two, because we're trying to get as much meter back. Okay, do your thing. I love AoE bustering a group of six enemies. It's the best. What are we at? Okay, that didn't kill all of them. Didn't even kill you. Okay, fun. Okay, that's fine. Charge gain. We'll do some regular fighting to kill these two. And then once all of them are back, we'll do another one with uh, Melu Oberon there. Okay, let's go. Let's go one. And we'll go... Because that should... Actually, you know what? We'll go... One, two, three. All right. That'll kill you. Nope. Almost. Almost. Okay. You're there. You know what? We'll do Melis... We'll, yeah, we'll do Melisines there. In fact, she should now be able to give it to herself. Yep. And then from that, we'll then do... The last guy will use Faker. Yep. That's what we'll do. What's just happened? Something just happened there. Um. Yeah. So we'll do this. Yep. Ignore the explosions in the background. Uh, once again, I am in explosion season, as as happened last year when I was playing Witch on the Holy Night, where just there's lots of explosions outside sometimes. All right. And what? Anyone survive? Nope. Good. Oh, it's Rongo Miniad. Okay. And we got this guy last. Okay, sounds good. So let's go. Boop. Let's go. Do we need this? No, that's just gauge up. Okay. Let's go. One, two, three. There's a, a huge chance this doesn't actually kill. Let's see. I think it did. I think it did. Okay. Sounds good. 
God, I love doing six enemies at once. There's like not been a time when that hasn't been the best thing ever. Like, kind, I mean, I guess there kind of is because, I mean, if they're actually strong, then they can really hurt you. But at the same time, then, then like, there's just so many advantages there being six at once. There's so many advantages. Okay. We're making our way. Slowly. All the way across. Red Rongo Minion. Okay. I'm going to assume we're going to have another fight that's similar to last time. Just a bunch of rando enemies. Let's see here. Seems like we got plot first. Not just a random battle. Damn it, they just keep coming. I can't believe I'm fighting a whole damn texture of the world, even if it is in the process of disappearing. I'd rather fight Darius and his whole Persian army any day of the week. At least there was an end to that, and at least all he would do is throw an elephant PNG at you. Oh, by the way, we have him at Caldia, so I don't know if you know that. Hey, Tanner, hang in there. I'm okay, I'm just a little tired. Nothing a quick suckle can't fix. Ah, don't give me that. You're obviously in no condition to fight. But if I have to, I'm gonna get back home. Back home. Yeah, that's right. I promised you I'd get you back home to your true body, didn't I? Out of my way. Freeze! Like, ooh, no! Damn it, I don't have enough magical energy for this. Even with my noble phantasm, there's too many for me to... Can you hear me? Conductor, what is it? I'm contacting you telepathically to inform you of our decision. We've been fortunate enough to collect eight mystic eyes on this excursion, so we don't mind using one or two of them now. You don't say. Look at you all. Generosity now. Difficult as it will be to part with them, I'm simply carrying out the acting manager's orders. I'm surprised you can tell what she's saying, since she's no more than a shadow now. Of course, I could never work for the Rail Zeppelin if I weren't able to. Now do be cautious as we dispose of these creatures. Whoa! Okay! Yo, Polar Express... Polar Express 2 goes crazy hard! Is that the train's eye in its opening? I completely didn't know this was the thing that happened. Maybe it happened in the anime and I forgot. Probably not at this case. It's the Rail Zeppelin's trump card. It can burn Mystic Eyes to make itself thousands of times more powerful. The last time I got summoned, it used that technique to incinerate me in the forest we'd summoned. Oh no, okay, that, that did happen and then. The only problem is firing it even once used up a Mystic Eye, and that's a pretty precious resource. Are there a... I was going to say, are there a finite and outbound? But no, like there is... They, people are born with them. Let's give you an idea of how much these things go for. The one Elmaloy bid on sold for $500 million. That's a lot of money. But how much is that in QP? I wake you up a little? I gotta say that broke-ass lord really hung in there back then. Not as much money as they sell for. The Rail Zeppelin values Mystic Eyes mainly for their own sake. It's gotta be absolutely killing both the conductor and the acting manager to use them up like this. Yeah, but then again, with, you know, they gotta pay us back and... Loading Mystic Eye of Burning Flame now. Complete. Commencing Mystic Eye Great Projection Sequence. Mystic Eye and Anchor Car Rilkabello Connection Complete. Analysis in... Three, two, one, complete. Securing extension of connected mystic eye. Opening spiritual revolving lens rose eye. Great projection of mystic eyes. Yeah, that's just a that's just a big laser. That's just a big laser. That's a really big laser. <laughs> that thing just took a bite out of the whole damn sky. 
Man, I'm glad it's on my side this time. The tracks are clear. Hang there just a little longer, Tanner. We're gonna really pour on the speed. Move, get out of the way. Nagarongo Mini is charging a shot. It's going to fire. Ah, oh, great. Just what we needed. Oh, no. More enemies in this game where we fight enemies. I mean, if it's the same one, why don't I just do it again? If it worked... And this time, I don't think we're going to need to use her, right? Yeah. So, freaking... Freaking, let's go. I just don't want to deal with it. I just want to press buttons and win. And God, this new suit here that allows you to do the... The change is very good. Very good. Again, I never liked the plug suit. Something about the plug suit I never really enjoyed. But this one, this is a real good suit. Call it my zoot suit. Because I zoot you with lasers three times and I win. Seven remaining. Okay, these are big fellas and there's... Okay, well, it's the same thing. It's just we're not jumping to the next one. Sure, whatever. Right? It's fine. They do have a lot of HP, though, actually. So let's actually make sure we kill them. So let's go with this. Let's go with this. Let's go with this. They're not human, but the buster stuff is good for that one. Uh, we don't need more than that right now. Should I do this or should I hold off? Um, One turn, increase... Yeah, let's do that. Let's go one, two, three. Okay. Oh, wait, what? Is that good or bad? Do we want to make sure that doesn't go off or do we want it to happen? That's the question. It's probably going to happen regardless. That will not kill them all. Oh, yeah, God, no. Okay, all right. Hey, thank you. Can you get me to 50? Nope, okay. Yeah, we're definitely going to have that fire off. Oh, man. Um. Okay, in that case, we are going to need to do more. So let's just do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Um, we don't have another one with you, but that's okay. Don't need that then. Let's go one, two, three. Okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's going to have to. It's going to have to go off. Oh, actually, that might have killed them all. No, this guy is, is still alive. Nice. Good. Oh, cool. It released and nothing happened because they're all dead. Maybe. Okay. Um, let's go with, actually, we can finish this off. Let's go with this on you. Let's go with this on you. This is still working. Let's go with this. Actually, we'll switch you and you. Yep. Okay. Okay. Now, the question is, do I want to go all in? I think I'm going to go all in. I think I'm going to go all in. Let's do this. Let's do this. Because, yeah, especially because we got this. NP strength up. Yeah, we're, we're, we're cooking. We don't need stars. I think we, I think this will super mega kill. All right. Oh, frick. Okay. <laughs> Guess that's that. Cool. Great. Just throw my hands up like I guess we did it. Okay. Sure. I don't know. I just kind of thought like it wouldn't do that much damage. You ever have a strategy and someone just comes in and beats you? Oh my god. I f yeah, I remember this face now. Yeah, I remember its design. Yep. Yep. I remember that now. Support only. Oh, geez. Well, time to see what we're dealing with. 
There's definitely more here than I thought there would be. That's for damn sure. Bubbles? My body grows cold. Feels like I'm sinking into a deep pool of pitch black water. It's getting harder and harder to breathe and I can't tell which way is up. My skin melted away long ago. My eyeballs, my eardrums, my sinews. They're all dissolving into mushy goo. And yet I still... Who? Huh? Wait, what? Tanner! Damn it, there's no end to them. Because I don't even know who that would be who's talking. Huh? Yeah. Even the Mystic Eye Projection Cannon can't clear them all out. It's only a matter of time till the whole thing melts down. We'll let it set in. Hey, hang in there. I can still fight. Don't be ridiculous. You're hanging on by a thread. From the look of you, you hurt so badly you aren't even feeling pain anymore. You don't have a physical body right now, remember? Push yourself even further. You have no chance of recovering. I'm not Orpheus. If you let, if you let yourself sink that deep, you can't count on me to come find you. But Orpheus Dorpheus. Nintendorpheus. Morpheus drinking a 40 in a death casket. Damn it, the chariot just took a direct hit. Ugh. Whoa. Whoa, am I falling? We're falling. Oh, you got hurt protecting me. Worry about yourself here. We need to get back to the train. Come on, let's... Actually, Tanner, let me ask you something while well, we still have the chance. Once you make it back, you'll reintegrate with your true body, but that version of you will just believe this was all a dream. Like Nemesine said, there's no guarantee your current consciousness will continue on within you. Doesn't that scare you? No? Yeah, figured you'd say that. I mean, I, I'm saying this in the role of the, 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 like, the character I'm playing. In real life, that would utterly terrify me. But even if you forget... I'll remember. Even if you, even if reintegration with your true body feels like death, or if your other self thinks this was all a dream, I'll always remember. Yes, that's right. I'll never forget either you or Dr. Heartless, I promise. So go home, Tanner. You have to live. Cool. We, yeah, can we get, we gotta go though. And we can't really do that here. Damn, looks like the surviving automata and steam ghosts already found us. Unable Phantasm can't take them all out. Hell, even the Mystic Eye Projection Cannon couldn't do it. Huh? You think I know exactly what to do? <laughs> I never would have thought of this if I hadn't kept my memories from my last summoning. This isn't my Noble Phantasm. If I push my luck too far, it'll shatter my whole spirit origin. Are you gonna use... Ionioi Hitairoi? Faker. Don't worry about me. Is some me gonna call ya. I told you I'd always remember, didn't I? And I'll still be me as far as you're concerned, yeah? I'm the same servant and I retain my memories. Middle ellipses. What do you think? Yeah, it'll still be you. Thanks. Just knowing you'll welcome me back like that someday is enough. That day is not today because I don't have the ability to summon you. Um, maybe a ticket? Maybe I'll get a ticket. Yeah, even I can't say for certain that it'd actually be me. But... I do know I'm grateful to you, and to him, for giving me a chance to make this choice. Rest easy, Tanner. I'll get you back to Kaldi, I promise. Oh, time for big boy nappies. Big nappies for a big boy. Alright, let's get started. Disguising true name, initiating false spirit origin registration, utilizing current pretender class to fabricate foundation, utilizing potential faker class to thaw foundation. Setting Virtual Noble Phantasm. Ghost Liner Reconstruction Complete. That's right. My name is Iskandar. I am Iskandar, the King of Conquerors. The expedition will not end as long as we remain ambitious. To victory! Ionioi, or Ionioi, I don't know how to say it. Hitairoi!
desert. Here in the city? Daytime in the middle of the night? That's a mindscape made manifest. It can't be. A reality marble. Even for a mage from the Age of Gods, that's still... Yo, they're stanced up. Look at them. They're ready to fight. Oh. Hey. Hi, actual Iskandar. <laughs> I never dreamed you would summon me one day. This is great. I can't believe I get to step into a fight like this, even as a heroic spirit. I wish I could sound like Jameson Price. Iskandar, the King of Conquerors! That, that's who he is. All right, my soldiers. Let's show them what we're made of. My king. Hmm. Only you, huh, Festian? It's a shame Ptolemy and Euminus couldn't join us too. Well, you just gotta wait two years for that one. He's in now. Even my great army can only fight so hard with foot soldiers alone. I know, this is only a fraction of your true noble phantasm. Even still, I can only maintain it for a few minutes. And that's even after boring your name to summon your army. With the power of the soldiers who are willing to obey me to help maintain my bounded field. But this was the most I could compromise. Whoa, whoa. Are you burning your own spirit origin for energy? I've wanted to ask you for so long. Why? Why was what why was that your dying wish? Why did you encourage the Diodochi, your successors, to fight among themselves? Do you still want to know? No, I don't need an answer from you now. I don't have the time. I have a promise to keep. Everything I learned led me to think you'd betray me. But now, right now... There's something more important to you than getting angry, huh? <laughs> now you're speaking my language. Very well, then. So we're up against the remains of a sacred lens that's trying to fundamentally change this world, huh? <laughs> I couldn't ask for a better opponent. Go on, my body devil. Roar in my stead. Yes, my king. The word king refers to one who lives bigger and louder than anyone else, who captivates others with their mere presence. A king is the envy of all heroes. They are the what they are the what everyone else aspires to be. That is why a true king never stands alone. With their noble ambitions, embodies the hopes and dreams of all their subjects. Well said. Well said, well said, well said. And I'll say it once more. Even if my spirit origin should burn and my soul should shatter, I say this for all the world to hear. I am Iskandar, the King of Conquerors. A-la-la-la-la-la? Okay. Alright, that's a bit of a weird scream, call, yell. Sure, it's probably historical. Probably some reasoning why they did that. I don't know. Honestly, I'm gonna be real. My knowledge of, you know, Alexander the Great basically comes from fate, and that's about it. You might be like, what, didn't you learn about it in school? No. No? <laughs> no. Oh, cool. It's playing... E wait. Wait, what? Okay, wait. Hold up. Unable to use Noble Phantasms, but it's turned... Off? Neutralize it. Grant partial command. Okay. I see. It's playing a song that I super can't play. Um... Yeah, it's probably best to just start with this, right? Oh, there's 15 of them. Oh, is this just going to be a, a fun battle where we get to, like, use them over and over? That'd be pretty fun, right? Boy, going between your Fate Zero music and then the... the yeah, going between the, the, the Fate Zero music and then the other anime music... This is going to be a big problem. Oh, wait. Oh, frick. Is she going to die as the battle goes on? What's going to happen? Okay. We got more of them. I feel like this is just a cool battle for the for the scene of it, right? Is he going to get it back? No? Okay, no. Now it's a, it's, it's, we're kind of in a real battle now. Okay. Um. Let's try and get as much back from you. Okay. Because we want to try and... Do that. Oh, is this not gonna kill him? Oh, frick, okay. He's 
burning. Uh oh. Oh, wait. Oh, good. Warm up. Okay. I didn't know that was going to be a thing because we didn't see it yet. And so this should now... Good. So now we can wipe out this and then next... Oh, wait. Oh, frick, wait. We might not be able to. I don't think we have anything that gives you meter. Right? Um, Actually, it's playing uh, the music from Fate... Uh, it's actually playing the Fate Zero music. That's why. Um, I can't... I cannot possibly play it. <laughs> There's no freaking way. Um, let's see here. Let's try and... Let's go... One. We could do a full combo and kill you. I bet you we'd kill you regardless early, so let's do that. Oh, frick. Well, never mind. I thought it was going to go next turn. Okay. Okay, we're fine. Ow. The okay, last one's here. Big fella. Big fella we can deal with. Ooh, it's a bad type matchup, actually. Uh, but it's okay. We'll do it. We'll go with this. We'll do this. We'll do this. We'll do one, two, three. All right, here we go. Big, nice overkill. You love to see it. And then... Ooh, so close. All right. You're still dying. Oh, thank you, Ioni. I had Tyroi. Frick, I forgot there's more. Frick, all right. Oh, geez. All righty. Well, we have good type matchup with both of them, really. Okay. Um, I kind of want to make you be the target. Let's do that. Okay. And let's go... A little bit of that each to try and get the stuff. I might hold on to it for the next one, though. Yeah, we'll we'll just do that. Yeah, so that then you can... Yeah, you got it there. We'll kill you this time. Big intimidation, null buff. That should be fine to last for a bit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, you're gonna hurt. Okay. Should we just kill you? It's probably the best idea, right? I think it is. We'll do that. Yeah, because then we can hit Tyroid the last one. Aqua cool. love nullifying the buff. It's fine. Okay, you're done. Oh, frick. The 1 HP advantage. What's the last one? Is it just going to be a bunch more? Three huge steam ghosts. Great. You love to see it. Okay. Um, jeez. Well, not the best for us. Wait. You can actually do it. Okay. We can, we can have you actually. We could probably kill the tough one at least. We'll go one, two, and then three. All right. Try and finish up here. That seemed to kill you. Yep. This is a cool fight. This is a cool moment. Everything about this is really cool, actually. That might have beat them all. It did. Nice. And you survived. Barely. Wow. That's some cool gameplay and story integration. Wow. You love to do it. Also, frick yeah, this is helping complete some of these missions. Good. Good stuff. This is, this is a, this is a, I'm enjoying this sort of ending here. Even if a lot of it is, you know, precipitated on remembering either in El Malloy or the actual plot of this and I don't do either right now okay well we're we making our way out it's also way longer than I expected it really is feeling quite a bit longer because I remember the King Proteus storyline being fairly nothing right it felt like it was you pretty much did a beginning and then an ending where this is like no you got a lot more everything I am is being stripped away
My memories are fading. I'm losing everything that made me human. Every record I have of my existence, it's all fading. It's so warm, but I'm shivering. It's so bright out, but all I see is darkness. Entity and transience seem two sides of a coin, as the flow of time itself appears to come to an end. So it doesn't feel right to think in terms of seconds anymore. But for every beat I count, I can feel something shattering. I'm already one with the darkness. There's no longer any distinction between myself and space, between myself and time. But even so... Even so, I remember something I once heard. I'll always remember. Is this our memories? Is this like us thinking this? I cling to those words. I'm not even sure where or how I'm having these thoughts now. They help me, help me guide me anyway. This way, you idiot. Could have sworn I just heard a voice that shouldn't be here. I feel a presence. Thought my senses were long since dead, but my heart feels something just the same. I've moved my feet again, though I was sure they had disappeared. I squint against the bright light that guides me. Also that, well, I can one day look back on this dream and laugh about it. This is us. Whoa. It's kind of, again, every now and then you get a lot of personality for, for Gudako. Even though a lot of people say that there's no personality, no, there definitely is. There's undeniable amounts of actual character to them. All enemies eliminated. We've escaped Nega Rangominia's sphere of influence. What about Tanner and Faker? <coughs> I see. Very well, as you wish. That translates to just frickin' leave him there. Like what? The rail zeppelin is now departing from the Patchwork London Singularity. All passengers, please remain seated. Once again, the rail zeppelin is now departing from the Patchwork London Singularity. All passengers, please remain seated. I guess we made it. Oh! Hey, look, a flying train! Goodness, it really is. We don't know trains could fly. Wait, is that a train? No, that's what I call golden. Must be headed for somewhere real far away from here. Hey, are we just gonna die, or... The battle is over. The music has come to an end. Why is thy luster now? Where is thy luster now? Ah, but of course, for this one night thy luster lies with the stars shining overhead. I never thought I would see a shooting star rising rather than falling. <laughs> It's as if we were in some kind of fairy tale. I see. So that's the light I see right before I die. Uh, nope. <clears throat> this is terrible. Just terrible. That is... In a sort of train, even my living self would have never imagined in his wildest dreams. Also, way more CG art than I would have expected for this. It's kind of beautiful. Oh, I got a click. Thank you for telling me. Because I would have stood here for weeks. Well. There's going to be an epilogue epilogue, right? Because we've had an epilogue, but now we need an epilogue epilogue. Right up. Hey. Yeah, there we go. Epilogue. I'm clicking. I don't care. That song hits my... <laughs> it, it makes me worried every time. Because it's, it's also copyright. Oh, frick. Baker. What's up, Tanner? What's a faker? When are you playing Sonic Adventure 2 again? I think it's a servant class. Really? Because I'm pretty sure that's not a servant class registered in Kaldia. Maybe not here, but it is in my world. Oh, hey, Elmoli II. Sorry to eavesdrop. I was just out for a walk now that I'm finally starting to feel I've recovered from the Nemesine incident. 
but I heard a word I'd not thought of in a long time. Tell me, how did you know of it? I think I heard it in a dream. A dream? Interesting. Do you remember anything else about it? Yeah. It's alright, take your time. There's no rush. Oh, yeah. Do you know who Dr. Heartless is? Indeed, I knew him very well. Well, it's not a name I ever expected to hear from you. Can you tell me about him? Of course, but be warned, it's something of a long story. So much so that you might want to buy ten volumes or so of it. I'll have to cover everything from the auction of the Rail Zeppelin to the grand roll at the spiritual tomb of Albion. The grand roll? Shut up. You didn't, you didn't go and summon at the tomb of Albion. I want to know. On second thought, I'm going to start at the beginning. I'll need to... Begin with Blackmore Cemetery. That's the original story with learning about Grey, which somehow got skipped over in the anime. Wow, you were just dropping big names left and right. This would blow Gordy's mind. He's like, wait, Gordolf, wait, Frick, he was there too. Which is exactly why I've been keeping it to myself. All right, I'm going to get into this. Grey would probably be here too. Oh yeah, by all means. Uh, I'm going to look for her. Of course, Rhinus might not be too thrilled about me sharing information about a parallel world. Really? Why not? It's fine. As I've mentioned before, I'm still technically a clock tower lord. There are many things I'm not at a liberty to discuss. Buddy, the world is ended. There's not much left for us otherwise. On top of all that, I've run into no shortage of issues since arriving in Caldia. Seems as if I run into someone I know no matter where I go. It's going to be real funny if Hephaestine walks in. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Yep. Wait. I... The only one way you could have met that last one is if you were summoned at the very beginning. Yeah, but true, you do seem to know a lot of people. It'd be fine if they were all just servants, but the fact there are present-day organizations and people involved well as well make for a host of difficulties. Freaking saw that Emya kid walking around. I can, if I must, ignore my obligations to the get to the dead. Not so the living. I was already passingly familiar with the Atlas Institute and the Wandering Sea. I also have ties to the Ryogi family thanks to a pad. You what? What? When? You can't throw this on me. You're gonna make me freaking read your novels. Really? Yeah, I didn't know you knew the Ryogi family. I must again stress that this only pertains to my world. As humanity is in a completely different situation here, I have no idea what else may also be different. It is kind of nice and refreshing that we have a character who just upfront says, yeah, not everything fits perfectly together in the Nasuverse, so don't 100% worry about it, right? It is kind of nice we have a character who is very upfront with that. A character who's like, I'm from this timeline. There are many other timelines where things go very differently, including this one. That said, I don't even want to think about what kind of problems I might cause by being careless and sharing knowledge about my world. To simply give you such information undeservedly could be a very, very bad idea. Still, in this case... Okay. Alright, come with me. I'd love to hear about this too, but I'll defer to your judgment here. Just fill me in in two if you get the chance, okay? I'll try. After what I've just said, this might seem contradictory, but here's what I think. I don't know how much you know about Baker and Dr. Heartless, but now that you do, I feel there are things I need to tell you about them. Not because they'll be of any use or bring you victory or reward, but because... Oh, hello, brother. Hello, my pupil. Sir, Rhinus was just about to put on some tea for us. Hey, <laughs> I still want to know where you get those fancy leaves here at Caldia. Whoa there. Didn't I tell you from the start not to pry into my sources? Wait, why is Estrella here? What? Uh, I mean, uh, sure, because she's, I guess, with them too sometimes. Hello, Grey Rhinus. My Rhinus, I still can't believe you were summoned as well, as if it were the most natural thing in the world to boot. Anyway, I'm sorry to interrupt your tea time, but I'd like to discuss certain matters on the clock tower with Tanner here. Do you mind? 
Excuse me, you there, mage. I demand to be present for this, too. What? What did you expect? How could I not be curious, given my vessel and the fact that I, too, have been summoned here? <laughs> After all, if I was there, I'm sure I must have done something spectacular. That's a unique sprite. I don't th remember that. Not because they'll be of any use or bring you victory or reward. It may well be that none of this is of any use at all. But sharing memories is what is what life is all about. Doesn't matter if this all seems like a dream or just something he imagined. What matters is that he gets back where he belongs. Even if what you hear ultimately gains you nothing. I really want Hephaestion to just walk in right now. Remembering and continuing to tell these stories will be my own salvation. Oh, really? Okay. That would have been so funny. Hephaestion and Iskandar and Darius just chilling in the corner. You know, that would have been great. I get why they didn't, though. Anyways, thanks for the lore. The name of Hephaestion's class skill has been changed to Obligation Negation EX. Oh, Oblivion Negation, rather. Okay. Whoa, the train tracks. Aw, oh, but they were cool. I liked them on the map. That was neat. Okay, hello. A new free quest and challenge quest have been added. Okay, so is this the Mystic Eyes? Okay, that's nice to have. Is this the new challenge quest? If it is, we'll do this one. Because I did the other one already once, right? I think the other one is... Because the other one, I think to get it, you have to do the other thing. You have to do everything, right? I think. Probably, yeah, probably have to do them all there. So I think this is the new one. Uh, in which case, I can simply uh, do this one. Let's see here. Um, this is, I'm just pulling up Game Press as per usual. Uh, challenge, I think this is Challenge 2. Let's see here. Um, because it's, okay, so it's Grey and Rhinus. Okay. Yeah, unlocks after clearing all the return quests. Um, so let's see here. Do you have a guide for this one what do you what do you recommend all right uh, let's see here um ch -ch 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 -ch. this is new main quest two break bar servants gray and rhinus gray will do the attacking rhinus will support her until she reaches the last bar where she'll go on the offensive gray starts with an np damage buff that lasts for five uses this is removable however Ooh, nice Rhinus starts by debuffing the party by uh, attack and NP 50%. Gray's first and second break give her one extra NP per turn. Okay. Rhinus first break inflicts nullify buff. Note these are all removable. Okay. Due to her class advantage and event bonuses, uh, NP5 Gray is very useful. Using Gray's remember to do her NB rank up quest. I did. Other AoE berserkers or uh, assassins work. Since both are uh, have human attribute, Coin Sky and Light and Morgan work well. Debuff Clear, it recommends, is useful. Uh, the new Mystic Code uh, from Caldia Uniform Decisive Battle from the Tunguska Epilogue also has a heal that removes offensive debuffs. Party Invincibility Evade is useful to avoid the AoE Noble Phantasm, especially since Grey will be given an extra charge with them. Uh, damage and NP Scage Support. So let's see, some recommendations are like... Gray, Rhinus, Koyan Light, and Oberon. It says you can do it in three turns. I may be able to do that. I might be able to do that. What is their setup here? It is literally... Wow. I might be able to do that. Let me try that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give that a shot. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use their team. I'm going to give it a go. Okay, let's see this. So it does. Okay, let's see. We're going to go with. Um, is there anyone else here that could be really useful just to put in the back? Probably an just another one of you in the back, even if I'm not going to use you. 
Okay, let's let's give this a shot. I'm gonna use this team that I see on here. I'm gonna go with instead of Buster Loop, which is the team I was using here. This is my kill saber. And, uh, I think it was. Yeah, it was. Okay, so it's we're gonna have gray. Gray, we're gonna want to have probably just somebody that does like big Buster up, right? Okay, and then we'll do uh, Rhinus. Rhinus, we're gonna get. Does Rhinus start with max meter? Am I wrong? Rhinus doesn't. Okay, we're good. Okay, so then Rhinus with um I'm just I'm just gonna I wanna try this because this sounds really fun. Rhinus will then get um this and then we'll get uh Koyan uh, uh is that yeah Koyan of Dorkness. I think I'm just gonna get the team and then just try it myself, right? I'm not gonna worry as much about uh, making sure I do it perfectly. Uh, and then with you, you get this. Put you in the back there. This becomes an Oberon. And Oberon gets... Oberon doesn't says, says it doesn't matter. Uh, so I'll go with... We're running out of, out of spaces, but it should be fine. Uh, what should we give Oberon, I think? Let's see. Not by level... Go by rarity. Let's see here. It's a good thing for you. Just just to have as a just in case. Demonic. I don't think there's anything that can do with human, right? Probably not. NP gauge 5% per turn. NP strength up. Sure, why not? We'll switch you out with uh you. Remove that. Okay. Well, I think this here could work. Let's see how this goes, right? I'm curious. I'm real curious how this is going to work. Um, yeah, I think this should be fine. Okay, let's see. What sort of crazy stuff do we do? So I'm guessing we're going to definitely pop super with the two characters that are ready to pop super pretty much at the get-go, right? Right? I'm assuming. We'll see what goes on from there. Oh, cool. More copyrighted music. You love to hear it. All right. So, bust her up. We're just a couple of ladies. Okay. Okay. You do, let's see here, remove debuffs for yourself. All right, let's see here. I'm going to try to see what it's asking us to do. Okay, let's see here. Um. Okay. Wait, were we supposed to try and get, how do we get them all to have meter there? I guess that's the question, right? Starting with... Because Grey was starting at 60%, which I don't think I have. I think... I think I was supposed to give her more meter. Brick. Should I give... Should I Should I give her... I have enough coins. I have enough coins. I could give that to her. Or should we just try... Hmm. So I kind of want to... I kind of want to be able to go right away. Okay, yeah, let's let's withdraw for now. I'm going to go, I'm going to buff up because I want to be able to pop that right away. Right? Yeah, I want to be able to to do super right away. We'll give you your meter. Um, Because, okay, I'm just, because I'm looking at the battle. She is starting at 60% and Rhinus starting at 90%. Okay, so I'm going to need, oh, can I do this if Rhinus is at 90%? Let's see here. Let's see. I don't know if I have enough Rhinus coins to do that. Uh, let's go with Inquisition. No, that's not going to help. Let's just go Rarity. Okay, so let's see here. Rhinus, I'm not seeing... I'm not... Uh, let's just go down. She's probably going to be down there. It's unobtainable, right? How many are we at with Rhinus? Where is she? Is she not here? Oh, wait, no, it's going to be higher up because it's by rarity. Um, yeah, we only have... 
Oh, son of a gun. All right, we might have to modify this. We might have to modify this a bit. Dang it. Okay. The plan goes out the window. At least we could do this with Gray. Um, we'll get Gray some more meter. Okay, let's go. Uh, pen skill. We'll give that to Gray because we do have enough for that for her. Uh, I think we do. Pretty sure we do. Right? I got nothing else to use this on. Yeah, we do. Gray. And make sure I pick the right one. Right? We'll load the magical energy. Okay. We'll at least start with that. Sure. Right? We can at least get going. The big thing is that we pop the damage right away. Okay. So then we'll we'll, we'll get these because we got we got more than enough. Like I said, I did grind the uh, the the uh, Barbados raid. Barbados? Barbados? I don't know. We did grind that a bit. Got some good money. Not like my friends who maxed out their 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 money, which I didn't do that. Uh, I definitely didn't do that, but it's all good. So we'll do this. Okay. Yeah, at least if we can start with max meter with you, then we can do some other shenanigans. Like I said, I don't want to necessarily just watch the battle and do it as it does, but we'll we'll see here and we'll use what we just got for that. Yeah, that works. Because what else am I using those for, right? Actually, do I have your... Do I have your skill up? Yeah. Did I do skills? I should check skills, too. Because I'm going to be real gray. I find myself using. Yeah. First off, though. um, Yeah, let's get you more. Okay. You need skills for sure. Yeah. Because you're 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 someone who actually I will use your like I'll be able to use you quite a bit, so you're good to have. This should help. I think we should be good to go then after this. Even if we're not as perfectly made for this apparent team, we should be running a bit better. Plus, I mean, you want to for your for your you know servants that are are rarity five. You do want to be able to to do, you know, stuff with them. Slight and in, P increase is really useful, right? Yep. Okay. Do I need the Volum Hydrangeum up? I might as well. And I might as well since I'm here. Okay. I'm wondering if there's any, like, command codes that are really good with her. I don't think there's any that are super useful yeah probably not really anything i mean anything that's not just like useful for everyone because there's like there's like certain command codes that you use and you're like oh this is really made for this one type of servant right um that's not really the case here you know what i might do yeah i think i'll do this i was gonna say for some reason my brain went to i want to also want to use koyan of uh of dark also, and I don't know why, my brain just said do it just because you can. It's probably a terrible idea. Don't do that. Why Why would I do that? Okay, so we'll get you. I think I'll just get um, Gray's, just her, her buff skill up more. And that should be enough. Okay, so let's go then to... Uh, she is four. Where is she here? Assassin. Gray, yeah. Okay, so we'll, we'll get that up. Right. Get more gauge. That's very important. The rest should be fine if you're not 10, 10, 10, I assume. And again, it seems to be using every... Oh, but we're looking at our money. Oh, God, our money loss. That's the big thing is the money loss there. Okay. That should be good for now. Right? I mean... I don't think special attack on dead. That's not going to matter a lot. Apply Invincible one turn. Yeah, we should be fine. Okay. All right. All right. I'm going to give it a go this time. Worst comes to worst, I got to revive. Right? All right. And Frick, we get a Grail for this. Wow. All right. So, I'm going to grab just another one of you, just in case. All right. We'll do that. Um. So, this will get 50%. 20%? Yeah, it should be good. I think we should be fine. Okay. Alright. Let's give this give this a shot here. 
I swear, we're literally only five coins away. That's the least amount you can be to getting her to have that skill. That's embarrassing. And I even had her bond grinding. Did I? No, I didn't. No, she wasn't bond grinding. I couldn't fit that. All right. All right, all right, all right. So here we go. Let's give this a shot. We should be able to do this now. All right, so Buster up. Go easy on us. We're a couple ladies. Hey, give me that guard there. We're going to go with this. It gives a little bit. We're going to pop this. 20%. Very nice. We can give this to you. Nice. Good. We give yourself a buff. We give yourself a buff. We can give you... Increase attack against human attribute. That's what we want. Nice. We'll pop this on you. We don't have a buster. I'm not going to use that right now. I'm going to hold off on using that. Right? Um, so let's go unspoken. Wait, let's go unspoken, Rongo, and then get some extra stuff. Let's see how much this freaking does, baby. If I do this perfect, apparently this will do three turns, so we'll see. Okay. Overcharge, remove, debuff. Nice. Ooh, I don't know if that's going to do it in one. It's not. Okay. Yeah, hit her, please. Okay, giving some meter. Okay. I'm going to release your seal. NP strength up. Oh, ruh row. Okay. Um, I'm going to do full combo on you. Kill you. Next turn, I'll do some more. Yep. Next turn, I'll do some more with the other stuff. Okay. All right, break gauge. I definitely did not do this as intended. Tears are like fine wine. Great. You got your super. That's a problem. Um, is this on everyone? For one ally. Great. Uh, so I'm going to do this on you. I'm going to do this. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll we'll just buff you up, right? Give you your, your best stuff. I am not doing this as intended. Um, I wonder if I should have did that to begin with. Let's go one, two, three. Okay. I feel like the other two are just going to freaking die. We'll see. That did a lot of damage. That did a lot of damage, actually. Nice, actually. Good. Decent. Okay. I wonder if surviving the Noble Phantasm will mean she'll be fine. Let's see here. And get her meter. Gray Rave. Triggers each turn. Okay, let's see what the Ultimate Mystic Kuh can do. What the frick? Okay. Right, because she's going to be attacking after this. Hey, I don't even need to switch out my party. She'll do that for me. Thank you. Kip. Okay. Oh, wow, you survived somehow. Nope, not for long. Thank you. That's that's good. Kip. Okay. Strength up. Attack up. Okay. So I lost a number of my buffs, but it's fine. I have the other Koyan to help out. That's perfect. Okay. Okay. And we'll get back our our buffs too so let's go with yeah let's do this we can then get this right we want kill human we'll go do we have a buster card with you we don't um but i'll i think i'll give it anyways we'll do this decisive power up we'll do this yeah we'll do it uh we'll do attack up we'll do this um this does... I don't want to use your, your Ender of Dreams. That's a bad idea. Yeah, we'll do that. And be strength up. Right, we'll hold on to that. Okay. That's a good idea. You're going to probably die. 
How come you have ups and downs? That's very weird. Your ups go away, but your downs don't. Strange. I don't know about that. Um, let's go one, two, three. All right, let's see how much we do. This should kill her. It is cool that this strategy is predicated on using our own Rhinus and Gray. That will almost kill at the end. Yep. So close. But the important thing is we got nearly enough to get our next thing. Oh, she's nearly dead. Ouch. Okay. All right. Um, well, we have enough for that with you. I'm going to pop a heal, actually. Just to survive a bit more. Because you're going to kill that. We're going to get the next one when we do this. Okay. We're going to pop this. Yep. Okay. As long as you survive, which I think you will. And we'll get... Yeah. Okay. All right. Cool. We didn't do this perfectly. We were doing this pretty okay. Okay, give us extra meter. We need at least... I forget the number that we need. Oh, I think we need 50%. I don't know if we're getting that. Oh, wait, no. Well, it would normally be 30. Okay, you're going to get your super next turn. Don't kill. Oh, no. Okay, well. That's not good. That's really not good. That's We might need a revive, actually. Frick. Wait, mash. We'll be able to do nothing. Well, we could potentially give a thing to one of you. Frick. Can MASH survive and win solo? It's gonna be mad tough. Oberon, Death Snow, right? Oberon's dead. Koi and Sky is dead. It's gonna have to be MASH in the end. Oh boy. Well, um... That's really our only choice. Okay. We're going to have to go with mash luck on the end because there's, yeah, there's no way otherwise. Um, for now, we're going to do this. We're going to go with this on you for the biggest buster up damage that we can. We're going to go one, two, three. Do the most that you can. Right? Big 100% buster there. Wow, that did nothing. Very cool. Never mind, I'm going to revive on this. It's fine. We tried. We tried the strategy. Okay. If it wasn't the fact that, like, like, I would have definitely redo this and try again and, like, really work hard on it. If it wasn't for the fact that this event was a pain in the butt to... Oh, we're just going to lose. Uh, if this event wasn't a pain in the butt due to the fact there's no way she could do this. You know, with the music and stuff. Because of that, the quicker I get it done, the better, honestly. I just want to get it over with. This is terrifying. Yeah, that's fine. We got the command spells for a reason. Let's use it and win. Yeah, let's just let's just finish this up. Watch it actually be like really difficult to finish up. No, well, no, we'll absorb her meter there, right? We'll do this. We'll do this. We'll do this. We'll do this. We'll save your meter. We'll not do that, but I will do increase. Yeah, we'll do the invincibles. Oh, frick, you're already invincible. Never mind. Well, that's fine. Uh, we'll go... Should I do... Try and get the meter back? I think I will. Just to be careful. Just to be careful, I will. I'm going to double it up to make sure we can get through, right? Then next turn, I can use the, the charge loss. Okay. 
Good numbers, good numbers. That's going to be about a third. Yep. Okay. Can you hit specifically Gray? Gray, please. Can you hit her? Nope, that's not That's not who I wanted. Um, That's okay. We'll give you a little bit more there. We'll give the 50% meter here. Right? We'll absorb your meter with that. Um, okay. Yeah, we'll go... One, two. Is wait, is the is the overcharge Oh, it's just meter up? Yeah, let's go. I'd rather do more damage. And then we'll do this. Okay. I'm just doing this to decrease her charge. That's it. Like, that's the only reason why I want to do that. This'll do a hearty chunk. Okay. If that crit, we would have won. Don't kill her right away. That's so close. Frick. Is this enough? I think it will be. It's not... It will be. Because um, we never use this in the end. Let's go with... Should we go overkill? Let's go overkill. Let's win. Let's win for sure. Okay. I'm going to kill you so freaking hard. Should, 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 I, should I do my hubris? Should I do it? I don't need to. I'm not going to do it. Just to be careful. Just to be careful, I'm not going to do it. Um, I know it's stupid to do that at the end, but it's fine. We got this. I could have done this if I practiced and did it perfectly, but it's fine. Like, honestly, these events are, are, are these extra challenges are silly anyways. Right. Okay. Okay. There we go. Perfect. Yeah, if we only had that much, then we might have been able to do, like, our whole thing. You know what it might be? I bet you the strategy involved, like, using um, more buffs to begin with. Because my problem is I'm always afraid to use buffs just to make sure I can do, like, I can get, like, the NP up and I'm not wasting too much NP. Like, that is an issue with me. I try not to waste extra NP because to me, like, that's the worst um, this seems to have no challenges for us, which is a problem, because I do need to go and, like, clear out more of these. That's where my grinding's gonna go next, is clearing out all the bonus challenges, getting to the second, um, well, the original challenge quest. Doing that one, probably do that after a few days, because get my stuff back and just have no issue with it. But, uh, yeah, oh, and there was a bunch of stuff. I got some rare prisms. I got more rare prisms because of the Da Vinci uh, workshop there. Right with the um, the demon's whale quest is now free. Uh, we did also get the Karna and Arjuna quests there, so I'll be able to do that. I'm planning to do the Arthur quest uh, once I finish probably a couple more uh, Fate prototype novels. And uh, yeah, that's kind of the the current plan. I need to get off this freaking menu with this music. I swear to God, and I can go back in and actually put the music back up now. Might as well do that, right? Okay, so let's go to game options. Yeah, we can put it back on now. Except this music, probably not. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. I'm talking over it, 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 talking over it. There we go, thank you. Um, yeah, so we got the the trial quests with them. That's now here. Um, I'm gonna get the Arthur one later because the fact there's plot with them is wild. Um the next major story thing. Is again, and I've talked about this before because it is something that needs to be addressed. I will be in Fuyuki during the next one because that's where I will be. I will be in Kobe, Japan. And as such, my plan is pretty much play it on my own, skip all the story, come back, and record the story. I've been told there's no bosses. 
nor is there anything special like, you know, Super Baby Karen, you know, that I need to worry about being spoiled through gameplay. So as such, I'm just going to have a nice chill time and do the story then. I will record my roles for um, for Bazit because that's a must get, but otherwise that's about it there. Yeah, and that's that. Uh, the one is just the new quest, right? Yeah, it's not an issue there. The one that I haven't done yet. But otherwise, um, we will be... God, I'm almost done all the interludes, too, that I had there. Not all of them, because I have, like, a lot. And we will be doing more in the future. Especially leading up to some of those, like, anniversary servants and stuff. Because I'm going to need the quartz. Um, not that I'm too bad for it right now. But I do want to get as much as I can, you know, leading up. But, uh, yes. Thank you all for watching, guys. And I will see you next time. For some more, let's play Fate Grand Order in the future. Ciao. Yo. Yeah.